Hello, today I'll be showing you on how to create spot height using Civil 3D. The first thing you do is go to your points and import your SD data to AutoCAD. You go to point creation tools, you come to import points, then you click on the plus sign at the top. As a data, you select it and then you open. You click on add point to group. OK. Then you click on zoom estate. Now the data has been imported, but it's not showing the details. It's not showing me my spot height. It's not showing me, it's not showing the depth. So I can do that by coming to my point group I'll right click on all points click on properties then I'll change this norm to point elevation description then I'll click apply ok now you can see now I'm having it I'm having my point and my depth on the screen mm -hmm. the next thing you do is you create a surface for your job you create a surface, create surface, then you give the surface a name. You can give it any name. Let me name it as Pop. Okay. Then you import data into the surface you created. Dimension point source, then add data to it. You add your SD data to this surface you created. Select the data. Open. I've add my data to the surface I created. Here you can see. Now the next thing you do is you come to your annotate. You click on it, then you come to spot elevation on grid. You click on it. Now you can see it's asking me to specify the grid base point. So I'll, I have to specify the grid base point for my job. You specify the grid base point for the job. Now it's asking me to specify a grid base point for the work. So I'll select the base point here and then it's requesting for the rotation I'm using 45 degree now it's requesting for the spot height interval for my X I'll use 10 0 for my X Y for my Y also I'll use 10 0 then I'll select the upper right location and I'll click on new is processing the data now you can see now the spot height is ready on the screen let me pull off the data that was imported from LZ so that you can see the spot height clearly you can do that by coming to all points you click on all points then you right click on properties you change point level style from point elevation description to none why the basic as well you change it to none then you apply and ok now you can see now on the screen i'm having the spot height clearly on the screen now then you can highlight this spot height by clicking on it then you right click you go to edit legal stuff and click on this you give it any height of your choice let me use 3.0 then you right click you click here I like this and you set the format 
that he wants the spotlight to be. You can as well give it color from there. Okay. Apply. Okay. Okay. This process is now you can see the spot heights have changed the test heights is now bold. Uh, thank you.